I'm Donna Visman with Williamson Source, and we're out here in beautiful Franklin and getting ready for the Chuckers for Charity event. So, James, can you tell us a little bit about this event? Sure. We've got a, we're have got going to have a high goal game tomorrow, and uh, one of the main features that we have at, at the game tomorrow is we've got a great international player here, Nacho Figueres, is also the face for Ralph Lauren Black. Uh, it's going to be uh, raising money for two great charities, Saddle Up and the Rochelle Center. And it's also located on one of Williamson County's most spectacular farms, uh, Riverview off of Moran Road. Very nice. And so you are part of a polo club here in Franklin. Can you tell us about that? Uh, yes, we're, we're, we're a small local club here uh, that's located on these farms. And uh, yeah, we play here on the weekends. So how many people come out and play? Tell us a little bit about the game since most people are unfamiliar with it. It's a, it's a, a quick way to describe it. It's a little bit like ice hockey on horseback. There's four players on each team. A uh, game is divided into six periods. Each period is seven and a half minutes. So each player will probably have at least eight horses tomorrow and we'll be switching them out constantly. And, and then obviously the ultimate idea is to score goals. Yes, obviously, and to win. Right. So we hear the name Chuckers. Can you tell us exactly what that means for people who may not know? Yeah, ch Chuckers is the traditional word for a period in polo. And so it's called Chuckers for Charity. So during the halftime of the game, is there anything special that happens during a polo match? Yes, absolutely. They invite all the spectators onto the field to come and stomp the divot and put all the, the field back together, which helps for the second half. And also they have a car show going on, a classic car show. I think they'll be giving out ice cream and there's another surprise that will be announced tomorrow. All right. Well, we're looking forward to it. Thank you so much, James. Thank you very much. Thanks.